Jason, what do you remember from your first days uh, as a footballer when you joined uh, your academy? At what age you started football? What do you remember back on these days? Um, I joined my academy, which was Crystal Palace, at the age of eight. And obviously, being a young kid, is you feel like you're in your dream then. But I think the most important thing is, is about enjoying it and turning up to the academy with a smile on your face and it being enjoyable but as much as you're ready, ready to willing to learn. Did you find it difficult to reach at the top level that you're now? Yeah, it obviously starts at an academy level, you know, you've got to be level-headed, but you don't really find that out until you get to 16, 17 and you sort of know where you're at and you've got to push yourself really when you sort of get to those ages. But the younger ages, you've really got to stay tuned in what you're doing and take as much as you can learn, but also make it enjoyable. What advice would you give to our children of our academy, of Puff FC Academy, that all of them imagine that one day you will reach a top level like you? Yeah, you, for, uh, definitely from a young age you have to believe, you know, but like I said, you know, cutting that fine line of it being enjoyable and learning things, you know, you still need to be happy, but the most important thing is that you're there hanging about at 16, 17, ready to make that next push. And what message would you like to send to the children that they are already part of our academy, also to the ones that they want to join our uh, academy? I think it's important for the ones that are a part of it, make sure you stay part of it and keep working hard to be part of it and don't get yourself sort of finding yourself getting pushed out of it by not doing the right things. And I think those kids that are not in it, don't get too disheartened, you know, because you could be 13, 14, 15 and get into academy and still make it professional. You know, just keep going and doing what you're doing. And uh, from what you, ca you have seen, every day you are here, you have seen how our academy works and uh, everything, the procedure that we follow. What do you think about uh, Puffer City Academy? I think it's good, you know. I think it's obviously it's a push now what the club's trying to produce with the young players. I think that's massive, not only for Puffer FC, but I think for the country of Cyprus, you know, keep trying to produce young players. And we want to see some of those players in the league. Thank you, thank you very much, Jason. Wish you the best. <laughs>